Welcome to RenewEnergy.com, your renewable energy and sustainability platform. At RenewEnergy.com, we believe in the power of clean, sustainable energy to transform the way we live and work. That's why we offer a range of solutions for businesses and homeowners looking to switch to renewable energy sources such as solar, wind, and water. As the world strives to transition towards cleaner and more sustainable energy sources, green hydrogen has emerged as a promising solution to decarbonize various sectors. Proton Exchange Membrane PEM, electrolysis is a leading technology for producing green hydrogen through the process of water splitting, where water molecules are separated into hydrogen and oxygen using electricity from renewable sources. In this article, we will explore the working principle of PEM electrolysis, its advantages, challenges, and the future prospects of this technology in the green hydrogen landscape. Working Principle of PEM Electrolysis PEM electrolysis is an electrochemical process that relies on a proton exchange membrane to separate the hydrogen and oxygen produced during the water splitting reaction. The electrolyzer consists of a PEM, which is sandwiched between two electrodes, anode and cathode. These electrodes are coated with catalyst materials that facilitate the hydrogen evolution reaction, HER, at the cathode and the oxygen evolution reaction, OER, at the anode. When an electric current is applied, Water molecules at the anode are oxidized to produce oxygen gas, protons, H+, and electrons. The protons then travel through the PEM to the cathode, while the electrons flow through an external circuit. At the cathode, the protons and electrons combine to form hydrogen gas. The hydrogen and oxygen gases are then collected separately and can be stored or utilized for various applications. Advantages of PEM Electrolysis PEM electrolysis offers several advantages over other electrolysis technologies, such as alkaline electrolysis and solid oxide electrolysis, which make it a promising option for green hydrogen production. 1. High purity hydrogen, the PEM effectively separates hydrogen and oxygen gases, resulting in hydrogen with a purity of up to 99.999%. This high purity hydrogen is particularly important for applications that require stringent quality standards, such as fuel cell vehicles and electronics manufacturing. 2. High Efficiency, PEM electrolyzers exhibit high energy conversion efficiency, typically ranging between 70% and 80%. This efficiency is due to the low ohmic and activation losses in the PEM, as well as the use of highly active catalyst materials at the electrodes. 3. Compact Design and Rapid Response, PEM electrolyzers have a compact design with minimal auxiliary components, making them suitable for integration with renewable energy systems, such as solar or wind farms. They also have a rapid response to changes in input power, allowing them to efficiently utilize intermittent renewable energy sources. 4. Low Operating Temperatures Unlike solid oxide electrolyzers, PEM electrolyzers operate at relatively low temperatures, 50 to 80 degrees Celsius. This lower operating temperature reduces the risk of material degradation and simplifies the overall system design and maintenance. Challenges Facing PEM Electrolysis Despite its advantages, PEM electrolysis faces several challenges that need to be addressed to enable widespread deployment and cost-effective green hydrogen production. 1. High capital costs. PEM electrolyzers have higher capital costs compared to alkaline electrolyzers, primarily due to the use of expensive materials such as platinum group metals for the catalysts and the perfluorosulfonic acid, PFSA, polymer for the membrane. Research and development efforts are focused on reducing these costs by developing alternative materials and improving the manufacturing processes. 2. Durability and material degradation. The components of PEM electrolyzers, particularly the membrane and catalyst materials, can degrade under the harsh operating conditions, such as high currents and fluctuating temperatures. This degradation can lead to reduced performance and shortened operational lifespans, increasing the overall cost of hydrogen production. Researchers are working on developing more robust materials and strategies to mitigate degradation and improve durability. 3. Scaling up and system integration. As the demand for green hydrogen increases, there is a need to scale up PEM electrolyzer systems to meet the required production capacities. Scaling up involves optimizing system designs, improving manufacturing processes, and addressing potential challenges related to the integration of large-scale electrolyzers with renewable energy sources. 4. Water consumption. PEM electrolysis requires a significant amount of water, which can be a challenge in arid regions or places with limited water resources. Research is ongoing to develop more efficient water management strategies and explore the use of alternative water sources, such as wastewater or seawater. Future Prospects of PEM Electrolysis 1. 
The future of PEM electrolysis in the green hydrogen landscape looks promising, with several areas of ongoing research and development aimed at addressing the current challenges. Advanced materials, researchers are working on the development of advanced catalyst materials that are more abundant, cost-effective, and stable than traditional platinum group metals. 2. This research includes exploring earth-abundant materials, nanostructured catalysts, and heterogeneous catalysts that can offer improved performance and durability. 3. Membrane development, efforts are being made to develop alternative PEM materials with enhanced properties, such as higher proton conductivity, improved mechanical strength, and increased resistance to chemical and thermal degradation. These advancements can lead to longer operational lifespans and lower costs for PEM electrolyzers. 4. System optimization and integration. Research is underway to optimize the design and operation of PEM electrolyzers for large-scale deployment, focusing on improving energy efficiency, reducing capital costs, and ensuring seamless integration with renewable energy systems. 5. Circular economy approaches. As the green hydrogen market grows, there is an increasing need to adopt circular economy principles in the design, operation, and end-of-life management of PEM electrolyzers. This approach includes the development of recycling and recovery strategies for critical materials, such as membrane components and catalysts, to reduce the environmental impact and improve resource efficiency. Conclusion PEM electrolysis has the potential to play a pivotal role in the transition towards a more sustainable and decarbonized energy landscape by enabling efficient and cost-effective green hydrogen production. While there are challenges to overcome, ongoing research and development efforts are paving the way for improvements in PEM electrolyzer technology, making it a promising option for meeting the growing demand for clean hydrogen. As advancements in materials, system designs, and integration strategies continue, PEM electrolysis is poised to unlock the full potential of green hydrogen as a versatile energy carrier and key component of a sustainable future. Thank you for choosing RenewEnergy.com as your go-to source for all things renewable energy and sustainability. With our YouTube channel, we explore the latest developments and innovations in the field, including hydrogen fuel cells and the use of AI and machine learning to optimize energy consumption. If you're ready to take the next step towards a cleaner, more sustainable future, visit us at RenewEnergy.com and discover the many ways we can help you transition to renewable energy. Thank you for watching and subscribing. Stay up to date on all the latest news and insights by subscribing today.